with the KX Storm Team. And good morning. It is 615. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. We've got a northwesterly flow here, an upper atmospheric northwesterly flow. You can kind of see there's a little bit of rain that wants to make its way into our neck of the woods. We could see a few sprinkles overnight tonight, but that's the extent of any kind of rain. But uh, a few clouds will stream into northern North Dakota later today. Right now we're waking up to a partly cloudy, if not mostly clear sky out there. So here's how that's going to go for the rest of the day today. We've got the strongest winds in northern and eastern North Dakota. Again, you can see here a few of those sprinkles that could could move through uh, some of the wind speeds are going to gust to as high as 45 miles per hour right now they're mostly pretty light out of the west and southwest around 5 to 10 or so barely a whisper compared to what they certainly could be later on this afternoon now the wind shouldn't be too much of a factor in the southwest but for the rest of us we're looking at around 20 to 25 and I do have some models that take us up to say 30 miles per hour I think that would be mostly up towards the north here some of the wind gusts, again, could be as high as 40 and 45, which is why the National Weather Service has gone ahead and issued a wind advisory from noon to 8 today. Now, with the strong winds, the warm temperatures, the very low relative humidity today, that's giving fire weather concerns, which is why we also have, to go along with that, a red flag warning beginning at the same time and lasting until the same time at 8 p.m., although it's just going to include a few more counties in the southwest into that. So, uh, our temperatures this morning, mostly into the upper 40s to low 50 starting off uh, relatively warm uh, seasonally speaking that is and then highs later today will be warm lots of 70s lots of mid to upper 70s some upper 60s to low 70s in the north some of our cool spots will still be very comfortable for today in terms of the temperature and tonight's weather mostly down to the 40s lighter wind in fact that wind will lighten through tonight to around 5 to 10 miles per hour with partly cloudy conditions we clear out and we get some sunshine for tomorrow we get a break from the wind as well it will stay northwesterly mostly around 5 to 15, but the highs will be in the 60s. And this happens to be our coolest day of the week, which actually is very seasonable for us. We're back into the 70s as we head into Thursday. I think we'll crank the wind speeds up a notch then as well. Here's the 72-hour outlook for Dickinson, mid-60s tomorrow to mid-70s on Thursday. A very dry forecast as well. Here's your forecast for Williston, uh, low 60s on Wednesday to mid-70s by Thursday. And we keep the warmth through the weekend. In fact, we really don't see much of a pattern shift until the beginning of next week. And that's going to start to signal more rain chances. It's going to bring in cooler temperatures. And this is the forecast for now. Um, my not, your seasonal average high is 60 degrees. So when we cool to the upper 50s like that on Monday, Monday, that is actually closer to average than all of the temperatures that we have for the rest of this weekend through the weekend. Here's your forecast for Bismarck, 60s, 70s, and you know what? We could even see some 80s by Friday. That is unseasonably warm for us this time of year, 70s through the weekend. And then again, rain chances are back in the forecast for next week. Alicia? Well, Amber, considering you create the weather, I think you've created the best weather possible for your special guest coming. I know. I know. And my, you know, and I'm happy to see that some of the trees still have some beautiful color. Yes. My mom is coming, <laughs> and I think it's like I have a countdown on my phone, something like, you know, a little over 48 <laughs> hours. Um, and I've got like literally hours to minutes. And so I, I told her this is a gorgeous time to come. She's with going to see some beautiful weather. Yeah, here. we've got beautiful fall and 70s. Man, you can't get any better than She's that. She's not going to want to leave. No, I don't <laughs> want her to leave. <laughs> Thanks, Amber. And keep it with us here on Good Day Dakota. Still ahead.